Hey guys, I wanted to make a quick video to discuss aging. So being that I'm in the field of plastic surgery, um, one of the main things we do is to try to help slow down and or reverse the effects of aging. Now I apologize if you hear a lot of noise in the background because we're currently doing construction in our new surgical suite. But I wanted to just talk about some of the factors that are involved in the aging process. So some factors we have control over and some factors we do not. So the factors that we don't have control over, one is our genetics. So the genes that get passed down from our, our parents, our great grandparents, et cetera, uh, we, do not, we do not have control over that, but it is a major factor as to how we age. Um, there are just certain groups of people that age very gracefully and there are certain groups of people that age more quickly. So um, nothing we can do about that part. Other things that you may not have that much control over is your underlying health conditions. Some of it we do have some control over, but things like high blood pressure, diabetes, if you have autoimmune diseases like lupus or rheumatoid arthritis, things like that can come into play and affect how you age um, as well. Now, some factors that we do have control over are more environmentally based, um, but things like sun exposure. So the more sun exposure you have, the more skin damage you have from the sun, and that ages you uh, earlier than somebody that did not have as much sun exposure. Smoking is another big one. So smoking causes a lot of systemic issues throughout the body um, and ultimately affects the quality of your skin. And you do wrinkle more if you are a heavy smoker, and we've all seen those heavy smoker lines um, on people's faces at times. So those are some things that you do have control over uh, to help slow down that process. Now, um, you know, there's different things to consider if you are interested in addressing those items surgically. There are non-surgical and surgical ways to address some of the aging features, um, whether that be through lasers to try to help with your skin quality uh, or your skin texture, certain fillers to try to help rebuild loss of volume in the face or fat grafting or other surgical procedures like facelift, neck lift, um, breast lift, things like that that happen as things age or droop uh, with time. So uh, I just wanted to share that bit of information with you guys. And uh, if you have any other topics that you are interested in learning more about, just leave them in the comments below.